So Corey, Alice, and I decided to try and answer the question. If we build a prison, but I do all the building and Corey does all of the redstone, uh, what happens? And the answer is trying its best vault. Honestly, look, please don't judge. I'm trying my best. This video is mostly just to show some of the highlights, some of the most interesting features of this prison, and just kind of see how Corey and I did, and if you feel like downloading it, there is a link in my Discord server. So uh, yeah, let's see how we did. But honestly, I kind of like how this looks with, with shaders. I'm too lazy to do the replay, but I'll show you a few shots. First is these uh, mosaic tile things. I, I don't know why I made them hexagons, but they are. There's also these fire things uh, across the bottom where I use these slime blocks and honey to make uh, the base of the fire and then a bunch of glass for the actual flame. And uh, these pillars with some very great shading, which totally isn't copy-pasted across the entire thing. We've also got this great billboard sign that um, has some kind of shadow, even though there's light blocks on this. Oh, and the portal entrance, which looks like a face in, like, absolute horrid pain. Of course, the outside couldn't be complete without a Ken shrine on the one side and a Cory shrine on the other side. So yeah, that's pretty much it. That's uh, that's my build here. So let's see what Cory did. To be noted, while I did give some advice, I did none of the building in here. All of this was worked out by Cory. So this right here is the five block tall entrance portal, which um, uh, surprisingly works. Like, seriously, if you press this button, it lights. So then of course you have your regular kill check and then there's a prisoner bed and a visitor bed. Prisoners will come up here where they'll walk along these uh, chorus proofed hallways right next to an x-ray glitch pig and um, I guess uh, set their spawn here. How they die at this point I, I, I have no idea. But after that the prisoner will respawn in this um, very original and very high effort cell. Oh there's also another x-ray composter here of course. Anyway visiting process the visitor will respawn up here another hallway where they'll uh, you know reset their spawn point of course. For some reason when you open the bed it um, I, gives you another respawn point here so you kind of can't do this at night otherwise uh, the visitor would just uh, respawn in here but you know what let's not think of it. Then they'll go through this very useful airlock up these stairs which you have to crouch to go up and then drop down the chute where you know they can visit the visitor and I guess the visit ends when they die but that's not even the best part the guard room is a functional cobble regen cell you thought Cory built that other cell because they were lazy no it was a design choice Cory is actually a secret mastermind of prison building this is the first prison to patch something that nothing else has and that is mutiny it's impossible for the guards to leave this room except for I guess this hatch where they can go to the x-ray rooms, but you know. Also, there's a functioning auto panic cap, which is also pretty impressive. And it leads to this note blockchain right here. So yeah, in total, that's pretty much, um, that's pretty much trying its best fault. Very simple. Uh, you know, definitely download it if you feel like it. Just, uh, don't expect it to be very good. After all, I mean, it's trying its best.